In this video, we are going to learn how to solve problems involving derived physical quantities and units for your jam physics. So these are repeated questions for this topic. So let's get started. We are going to practice with five repeated questions basically. So the first one I have here says which of these units is derived? So option A we have mole, option B we have column, option C we have Ampere option D we have Kevin. So guys the correct option to this question is option C column. So mu is a unit of a fundamental quantity which is amount of a substance. Ampere is the unit of a fundamental quantity which is electric current. Then Kevin is a unit of a fundamental quantity as well which is temperature. So column is the only unit here that is derived. Alright, so that's it for this question. The next one will be this. It says, which of the following is a derived unit? We have option A, meter, option B, kilogram, option C, Kelvin, option D, Newton. So for this question, the correct option will be option D, Newton. Alright, Newton is the unit of force, which is a derived quantity. Others, we have here, Kelvin, kilogram, meter. They are all units of fundamental quantities. Meter is for length, kilogram is for mass, Kelvin is for temperature. Okay, so that's it for this question. Let's go to the next one. Alright, so this is a third repeated question. It says which of the following are the correct SI units of the quantities indicated? Alright, now for this question, let's begin with IV and progress upward. So we have IV, we have pressure. For pressure, the SI units we have here is correct for it. Well, for power, the SI units we have here is not correct for power. For momentum, the SI units we have here is not correct for it. For tongue, the SI units we have here is correct for it. So basically, from the options we have, the correct option for this question will be option C which is I is correct the unit of tongue is Newton meter and pressure is correct the unit of pressure can be this though pressure has a standard unit to be Pascal but this can also serve kilogram per meter per second square alright so the correct option is option C that's it for this question so the next one is this which of the following units is derived so we have kilogram we have Newton, we have meter, we have Kelvin. So the correct option is option B. Newton. Newton is the unit of force. Force is the derived quantity. Alright. So the last repeated question will be this question. It says which of the following unit is derived? Alright. I think we have solved this question. That's just the one we finished solving. So the correct option is option A, which is Newton. So that's it for this video. Hope you learned something interesting. On this video let's call it a video here, guys if you are new to our channel ensure that you subscribe to this channel for more of our videos also like share and comment on this video then how you feel for what i learned from this video if you seem to have any specific questions to ask regarding what i've talked about in this video feel free to give a question at the comment section below and i'll ensure to give you a response now click on the screen and button i see you in the next video thanks for watching